for this video, I'm doing everything using free elements, free images, and free designs. Look how pretty this is! Hi there, it's Trixie. Welcome or welcome back to the channel. Today I will be sharing with you one of my most helpful and favorite mom hacks, which is how to create your online DIY party invitations with RSVP links using Canva and Create eCards. Big thanks to Create eCards for partnering with me on this video and helping make party planning so much easier, especially for busy moms like us. If you love creative ideas, fun and easy DIY hacks, and tips on simplifying mom life, make sure you're subscribed. Okay, let's dive in! All right, so I'm on my laptop and we are going to go to canva.com. To start creating, you have different options. You can type in whatever you want to create over here. You can type in invitation and it'll show you all different kinds of invitations. You can create different kinds of birthday invitations, wedding invitations, save the dates, 18th birthday invitations, invitations for baptism, gender reveal, baby showers, and more. Another way is to simply click on this plus sign over here on the left side and you can go from there. One more option which I usually use is simply by clicking any of these shortcuts right here. So you'll see all the projects that you can create. You can always click on more to see more projects. So for invitations, you can do a portrait one or a landscape. You can do a square invitation, um, basically anything. But for today, we will be creating a five by seven inch invitation. If you have a specific size and you don't find it anywhere here in the samples you can always click on custom size over here on the left side but yeah we don't need that because we can simply click the one that's here so once you click on the project it will give you a blank sheet on the left side is where you will see everything that you need to be able to create also once you start creating there will be tools up here that we will be using okay so first we will go to design to search for templates once you're here you can type in invitation or you can just use keywords as well for today my daughter loves mermaids so i was thinking to create a mermaid themed birthday invitation for a third birthday basically you'll just pick the design that you like for this video i'm doing everything using free images and free designs if you do not have a pro account you would want to avoid picking designs that have this crown image because this means that you need a canva pro plan whether it's pro or not honestly canva has so much good options okay i think i want this one right here you can honestly create an invitation here in canva in less than two minutes because you're just going to replace the text that's here and download it and that's it if you want to add rsvp you can easily link it with create e cards it's super easy and you're gonna see that right now so yeah here's the design that we picked let's pretend the name is brianna and she's turning three Let's pretend the birthday is October 23, 2025. Let's do 1 p.m. And let's just stick with this pretend address that we have here in Canva. You can edit all of the text that's here. If you want to move the text or image around, click on them and drag. I think I want to make this smaller. And then this one I want to bring up here because I want to put the RSVP QR code, which I'm going to show you later on. When you want to add an image, you just go on elements. What I want to add is a number three. I'm going to pick this one right here. So I'm just going to blend it with all of our other images by changing the color. You just go to the tools up here and then click on color. So I think I'm just going to use this one and I'm going to make it a little bit more transparent, which you can do using this button right here. Let's do that. There you go. Let's bring it a little bit up here. I think that's perfect. You can go off with this, but I wanted to show you how you can also add animation to your invitations because another good thing with Create eCards is that they support animated invitations. So I think I want to add bubbles. You can type in moving bubbles or animated bubbles. We can use this one right here. You can adjust the size, you can adjust the colors, and you can easily 
duplicate your image by clicking this one right here and then move this around obviously there's so much more that you can do here but i think our invitation looks really good already okay let's go to create e-cards to do that you just have to go to apps here on the left side and then here on the search bar you can just type in create e-cards it'll show this to you just tap on that tap on their logo and voila we're already at create e-cards and here you can see that you can watch a tutorial but this is pretty straightforward so we can skip that because i'm going to show you how to do it anyway there's so much fun things to explore here in create e-cards so here for media you can add our animation you just tap on it and then go to slideshow all we need to do is get a code from canva to copy and paste over here this way when we send out our invitation our animation will be there so to do that you just click on share over here just go to see all and look for embed click or tap that and then click embed and this one right here on top you just copy and paste over here Control v for paste another option that we have here once you get to create e-cards is to create your own qr code so this is best if you want to print out your invitations but i still put a qr code even if i just send them digitally just so i have both options open and yeah it's also helpful for the guests as you can see you can also design your own qr code which is awesome you just tap add to design and it'll add it in there make it smaller scan me or tap and hold to rsvp there we go now we can go back we can also click on this last option over here it's so easy you just copy and paste this one it has instructions here as well now we can sync our design by tapping this one click on online invitation and then sync to create e-cards and then click export continue and it brings you to the website of create ecards so this is where you will either log in or create an account and once you log in you can click this awesome feature that they have it says save time with magic fill which i do recommend what it basically does is that it analyzes the invitation and pre-populates all of the details that's in there and even matches your design with the whole like background and the text that they use everything is customized so let's just click on continue for page one it says event details we will keep this on because we want to collect rsvps for their free account you can collect up to 15 rsvps but remember that those 15 have their plus ones and their families so it's basically 15 families maybe that can be around 40 to 100 people and you can easily upgrade if you need more you don't have to redo everything from scratch it's so affordable it's so easy to upgrade which i honestly think is worth it because of all the time that you will save plus everything looks so pretty and professional and it's just so hassle free so basically you just fill out everything that's here there's prompt so it's so easy to fill out here's one more cool thing that they have they have this maps link so basically you can paste any map link here you can search in google apple or wherever let's do the address of disneyland california just for fun so you can just click on the maps right here and click share copy link Go back to the Create eCards website and paste the map link over here. Down here, you can add gifting options. Personally, I do create a registry for my twins. It just helps me a lot and it helps all our guests. So yeah, gift registry name, Giannis third birthday gift registry link let's just put a pretend link let me just put my amazon storefront for now i just clicked enter you can add a second registry if you want let's check our url if that works there you go so you can limit your number of guests down here for additional guests let's put maybe five and that's it for this page next we will customize here in the customize page you can add meal options so this is perfect for weddings and big events let's just pretend there's chicken tenders and fries another meal option can be cheese pizza and spaghetti but again this is optional and then the event description you can put additional details you can delete some of these right here now we go to style and you will just see that you have options for 
the whole look of your invite. So we'll keep it to original. For the banner text, we can put calling all mermaids. The theme color, maybe we can change it to purple. There you go. I think that looks better. Wallpaper color, let's change it to blue. Oh, I think that looks so cute. There's so much you can do with your design. You can even add your own photo or wallpaper. After that, when you think everything looks perfect, you can publish. It'll take you to this page wherein you can customize the last part of your link, which I think is awesome because it makes it more personal and special. And click publish. Look how pretty this is. So this is what your guests will see. I love it so much. Once they receive this, they can RSVP, input their email address, click on next. If they're going, they just click on yes. Adult or child. A meal preference continue here is the section for the plus one so we'll click confirm and we can click next this is where they can just say whatever they want excited to celebrate with you you can click ok email updates about this event yes purchase a gift let's click this and it brings us to our pretend registry and there you go so that's how they can RSVP now you can start sending your invitations just click on start sending you can copy the link and simply paste it on a text message on iMessage on a chat app you can also share it and you can include a share link text you can also email and what's good about this one is it's so easy because create eCards has a template ready for you to just copy and paste so that you can send from your personal email address they also have marketing tools right here and you can send to your phone which I use most of the time for this one you can simply use your phone to scan this QR code right here to be able to access the phone version of your invitation which you can easily send to everyone to manage your RSVPs you just click on home and go to your dashboard here you will see all the invitations that you've created at the bottom you can see view RSVPs so here you will see the replies, those attending or not attending, and those who haven't replied yet. You can also look at the guest list and answers over here. Message wall is where you will see all the messages, which I think is really nice to have and it gets you more excited about the event as well. And then over here are Amazon suggestions from Create eCards that are all party related. So yeah, that's basically it. Everything you need is right here. Everything is very easy and fast. I'm so thankful that we have Canva and Create eCards to make this possible. And that's it. How easy was that? Again, a big thank you to Create eCards cards for sponsoring this video and for helping moms save time. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to share it with your family and friends. Subscribe for more mom hacks and leave a comment below on what you're celebrating next. Also, don't forget to check out all helpful links and info down at the description box below. Thank you again for watching. Together, let's make happiness happen every day and live the lives we love. I'll see you in the next video.